Yo, what, what, what up? 你要见还是我？ It's Razor Pop, lah. Hello, welcome to Razor Pop. It's a year of the ox, but why are we standing in front of a rooster? Well, that's because we are going to interview someone who is born in the year 1981, and we are talking about Calvin Chen Weilian from Project Superstar One. Well, over here it says the characteristics for roosters generally、uh, include people with strong pride. People who are boastful, power-hungry, and clever. I'm not sure whether these characteristics apply to him, but let's check it out with some of his fans over here first. Hello. Yeah, these are all Calvin's fans, right? Yeah, so you're going to catch his performances、uh, at the River Angbao concert. But first of all, let me ask you whether William is boastful. Is he boastful? No. no. No, no, not at all. I have an affable personality that everyone makes him like from all ages. They like him. Okay. <laughs> What about clever? Yes, 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 yes. Smart. Yeah. <laughs> Smart. Yeah. Okay. Uh, sometimes we do ask him how to use the internet or maybe how to use a Nokia handphone. He's actually pretty expert in that. Is he clever in any other ways? He is improving his. Uh, song composing skills.、Yeah. We heard that coming album will have a few numbers. In fact, tonight he's going to sing one of the、yes, new song. Of new And what's the name of that song? No, no leave it to suspense. Yeah, <laughs> no, <laughs> I'll tell you later. <laughs> okay. What about strong pride? Do you think he has strong pride?、Uh, strong confidence. I think is in every artist is important, very important.、Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay.、Uh, what about the last one? Power oriented, like someone who who thinks power is very important. Do you think that's the case? No. 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 Music is supposed to be a、uh, enjoyment of singing and performing, so it treats it as if、uh, it's a job as well as a passion.、Okay. So it's not so much of a power, but more of a goal and dream driven.、Uh, do you have any advice for William this year? I mean,、uh, for a rooster,、uh, not to go for swimming. No, no, swim, 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 Yeah, but this year probably he will have like even better luck when、uh, in the overseas market, right? So do you look forward to his performance later? Yeah, yes, yes, that's yes. why we're all here. We're <laughs> coming again tomorrow. So. Yeah, and you can't wait to grab a seat there, ready, right? Okay, okay, I'll let you all go. <laughs> and later we are going to interview Calvin at the backstage after his performance, and we'll check with him whether he himself thinks he's a boastful, clever, or power-hungry person. Stay with us. Within here, yeah. So, how did you enjoy your performance just now? Uh, today is the first night, and yeah, I would say that、uh, based on、uh, the crowds, right, the the general audience response,、uh, I think it should be not too bad. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Actually, there are many parts that are quite funny because I I heard like that there's like quite a lot of laughter in the crowd when you said something funny. I I I forgot what was funny lah. I I don't I don't intend it to be funny lah. <laughs> we'll show you again. We'll show you the footage again. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, did you celebrate、uh, Chinese New Year in Singapore? Yeah,、uh, yeah. So far, I have been rather lucky to be in Singapore so far since uh since yeah since birth until now every year Chinese New Year um um yeah I'll usually be in be in town lah yeah.、Right. So is this the first day that you start working? The、uh, in terms of Chinese New Year, yes, yes. In terms of the new lunar year, ah,、uh, yes, yes, yes. So it's a good day to start work. You know, actually on Yuan Chu Wu, according to the Lunar New Year Chinese、uh, calendar. Yeah, that's right. Does it count or not? Because I started work a few days already. Yeah. <laughs> Today is the official start. Yeah, the actual one, lah.、Mm. Uh, Do you get like any ang pao from your fans? Because I heard, you know, some of them actually gave you ang pao. You know, in the past few years. Yeah, because it、uh, happened that there was my、uh, when.、Uh, During my first album release, it was around this、uh, Chinese New Year period, and ha I haven't had、uh, this、uh, have this autograph session. That was the year that yeah I received quite a quite a quite a fair bit of uh, uh, unbounds from my fans. Ah,、uh, yeah, yeah.、Okay. What about this year? Ah,、uh, this year no lah. This year basically family and friends, and yeah, yeah. Probably because of the economic crisis,、yeah. so they are cutting、mm. down their budget as yeah, well. I'm not sure lah, but so far I, because I I don't have a habit of opening the unbounds until after New Year lah. Okay. 
I mean, actually, the, last time when I was young, yeah, I, I'm very eager to open, you know, as I reach home, wow, how much, how much, how much? You know, but now, lately, these few years, uh, yeah, I think a bit high say to open also, like, I don't know. Yeah. Because you're earning big bucks, you know, on your own. Yeah. No, no, even before I, I mean, before I became a so-called celebrity, yeah, I was also, I was also like that already, like this, this maybe, this, yeah, this seven, eight years or so, man. Yeah, since the millennium, lah. Basically, I, I started to become like that already. Don't know why, lah. So you're not interested in angbao money anymore? Who is not interested in money? Everybody is interested in money. So money is very important to you. Yeah, but don't know, maybe, I think it's some, some, don't know, I just feel that maybe, uh, has some good, maybe some good luck, lah. Maybe you open after New Year. Right. Uh, just some, just some, my own personal superstition or what, I don't know why, lah. So you stick to that tradition, lah. Okay, I don't know, we'll see. Yeah. Back to music, you know, just now uh, I heard Sing Guang Pan Wo Sing, yeah, which is your person. Now the title wrongly, actually, Sing Guang Pan Wo Sing, and I say Sing Sing Pan Wo Sing. Anyway. <laughs> okay, then I got it right. Yeah, somehow I got it right. That's good. Is that your first personal composition? Uh, uh, yeah, if, if you talk about official ones, yes, yes. Official ones, yes. Uh, it is one, it is the first to so called Liang Xiang in the public. Lah. Uh, yeah, but I, I mean, there are, there are also others in, in my upcoming album. Yeah, this is, uh, I would say, this is the one that I would say more suit today's, uh, like, uh, like this occasion. Lah. How did you come up with this baby? Like, how, how do you get the inspiration for the melody? Actually, this inspiration comes from, uh, what happened was, it was, I'm known for singing sad, more sad songs, you know, to touch people. Yeah, so I think that in my mind I was like trying to, wow, trying to make some, trying to write something more jovial, more happy. I got the chorus first la. It's, it's a very simple The most important In terms of uh, catchy uh, Upbeat songs You need it to be catchy So I, I hope that This is catchy enough la, You know basically uh, yeah. I mean the mood of the song is It should be a happy one You know yeah, Do you compose it on your guitar Or yeah. piano? Yeah So far Like most of the songs I did on guitar la, But there are also some That I did on piano also yeah. yeah And the lyrics was penned by Liang Wenfu uh, yes, For this song, yes Yeah And I also heard that Ling Xi from Hong Kong Also wrote a song for you in this album Yes, yes, yes wow. Okay, and Okay, the story that I heard goes like this, okay mm-hmm. Ling, um, I think your record label yeah, yeah. Warner Music Approached Ling Xi, you know To pen some songs for the artist uh-huh. But Ling Xi didn't commit to it Yeah, He didn't oh. accept Or he, neither did he decline the request But when he heard that the song Is meant for Chen Wei Lian Then he said, okay, I'll do it So is that true? Uh, no, because hap- it so happens that uh, 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 Ling Xi also ever uh, 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 he, uh, he, uh, My English must be so good no? he, he ever hear my voice okay. oh. he ever, he, I mean, he has, he has heard uh, He has heard me, you know uh, in, I, don't know, I don't know how has he heard about me la, okay. But basically he has heard, heard, heard me before so I think yeah, it so happens that yeah, he he yeah, kind of uh, yeah la, impressed. Uh, I, I, I I don't know how to yeah, I don't know how to say such things. You see, sorry, uh, yeah. Oh, I don't know. How to uh, say. You're not a boastful person, right? Uh, huh? Are you a boastful person? No, it all depends on depends on. Right? Uh. We were outside and we saw the we saw their, uh animals decorations uh-huh. and on the board it says you know people who are born in the year of rooster tend to be boastful. So I don't know. Yeah, is that true? I don't know, Lee. I don't think so because you, you don't seem to know how to you know boast about yeah, yourself. I don't yeah. Know how to boast, Lee. Oh. I, mean, I can I can be very yeah, if I want to, uh, but that'll be very uh, not me lah. Not you. Yeah, okay. yeah. Lizzie said I sing very well, lor. Yeah, I'm the best. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, uh. Quite naturally, right? <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. On the board, it also says you know like personalities uh-huh. for people who are born in the year of rooster also are also very clever. Uh-huh. So is that true? Clever. Yeah. Clever. Okay lah. If I clever, <laughs> ayo, I don't know leh. <laughs> Whenever I can write lyrics already. Oh. <laughs> you can compose melody. Okay la, yeah la, but and you can bow. Yeah, you can. Okay you are street. Uh, you are tech savvy, uh, according to your. Okay la. Okay, back to Ling Xi. Yeah. So, so he hurt you somehow. I mean, that's what I heard from the boss la. Basically, yeah. James and he 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 told me that oh, Ling Xi kind of uh he 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 yeah, because you've been promoting your albums in Taiwan and China. I don't know where, where he has heard me, but if you talk about like Hong Kong, but he's, he's, he's from Hong Kong, but of course I'm sure he watch, watches uh, Taiwan shows. and Yeah, but actually in terms of Taiwan TV programs, I, I did not uh, had much uh, TV exposure in Taiwan actually. Yeah, so yeah, I'm kind of surprised. So I think 
It's fated lah, fated. Ha, ah, ah, boastful, boastful, fated, man. <laughs>